If everybody could now take a seat, as the moment you've been waiting for has arrived. Without further ado, may I present to you, Mr. I am not the boss anymore. Now we know Oren and Drisha are soulmates, but I have managed to confirm this with photographic evidence. This is what I believe to be the essence of Oren and Drisha. Not a care in the world about anything except for each other. I think when I was very, very young, I used to find the idea of love strange. I used to think I'll never care about anyone else as much as I care about my parents, my brother, my sister. It was just when I met her, I, I walked away thinking, what? What just, what just happened? I wanted to feel home, and I think Drisha makes me feel home all the time. Aaron's my first relationship, actually. I went a long time kind of looking, but not really finding. I just wanted my person. I got so lucky with Aaron. Like I always say, he's like so far beyond the perfect person for me. I'm not perfect, but that's what makes me perfect for her. Trisha could see me clearer than anyone had ever seen me before, the real me. She refused to watch anything I put online for the simple fact that she wanted to know me for me and not what I did or who I presented myself as. That or she just didn't like my videos. <laughs> I could slowly feel all those burdens I've been carrying becoming bridges and my insecurities melting away. The things I'd spent my entire life hiding from the world, she showed me how to be proud of them. And with this unconditional acceptance, by embracing me the exact same through both the good and the bad, Drisha opened me up to love. When I'm with him, I feel like he just like gets every part of me. Like this is what it feels like when you meet the person. What it felt like with him, just immediate like home. So it's probably not surprising that it only took eight dates before I knew I wanted to marry this girl. Because my entire life, if you'd asked me where I wanted to be, I would tell you one thing and one thing only. I want to go home. Except this moment, I realized that my answer had changed. <laughs> I want to be wherever she is. And that kind of feeling of change, of what home meant to me, was love. If you could go back in there, and that little girl, was waiting to be there, what would you tell her? Uh, just not to worry, because she's going to be loved beyond her expectations. Like, the amount of love that Aaron gives me is just pure everything from him. It feels like confirmation that you should wait. <laughs> You'll find the person. You'll find the person. They're out there. Never settle. Never settle. So, standing here today, underneath this vast, vast cosmos, surrounded by all the people we love, Drisha, I want to thank you because now when I look at the same sky every single night, I don't see endless, uncaring emptiness. I see peace. You show me the stars where I previously saw the void. 
Now that I see what my life is like with you, Drisha, I refuse to believe that my life could have been without you. Now that I found you, girl, I'll never let you go. You see my soul, your love makes me whole, and here in your arms is my home. Cause you see my soul, your love makes me whole I just wanna be with you Forever Aaron doesn't express his emotions a lot But when it comes to Trisha in particular He's like if it's a little boy, isn't it? Where's my wife? <laughs> I think the channel is very much tech focused. What the camera doesn't show is Aaron's emotional side, but we see a different side, you know. As family, right, we will. Either I am the luckiest man in the world for bumping into this angel, Either every single star had to align in my favor or, or it was going to happen. We were meant to find each other. Two people, born and brought up over a hundred miles apart, but so unbelievably designed for each other. That's what I choose to believe. With you I get all my highest highs and with you I can conquer the mighty oceans. And darling, now with your hand in mine, I can reach for the stars. Mark Twain once said, the two most important moments are when you were born and when you found out why. And now that I've found out why, my life is so simple because it doesn't matter how much I probe, the answer to every single question, no matter how complex, is the same. I love you, Trisha, my wife.